Welcome back to Friday 13th YouTube channel, Metalheads. Today we're going to be talking about a very different album. This is a very chilled out album. It's not a metal album, but it's a very interesting album. The band's called Dark Skies. They've just released a new album on Napalm Records called Dormant. Now, the band have released two previous albums. Some of you guys out there may not have them. The first album was called Satellites, released in 2020, followed by the second album, Nectar, in 2022. So you're probably asking, who's in this band? Well, it's only two musicians. First of all, we have the fantastic Thomas S. Lundgren from the band Evergrey, who plays guitar and vocals for Evergrey. On this album, is only handling the vocals. Joining Tom would be a fantastic pianist and composer called Vikram Shankar, who's a fantastic keyboardist. He's wrote some fantastic songs. Some of you guys out there may have seen the recent interview with Vikram. If you've not seen it, check it out. I'll put the link at the end of this review. When I first discovered Silent Scars, I wasn't too... When I first discovered Silent Scars, I wasn't too sure what to expect. But pleasantly, I was really enjoying what I heard, especially with the new album, Dormant. It's very classical influence, but it's also very gothic and dark. There's no guitars on here, no drums, but it's a really, really interesting album. There's some fantastic singing by Tom here. He's really putting his heart and soul into it. And Rick comes doing some amazing composing and keyboards. If anything, there's some percussions on here, which really gives it a bit more of a flavour and vibe. I like the way that... the I like the way that this album is beautifully composed. There's some fantastic elements on here, really well-structured songs. On this album, there's 13 songs. So I'm going to tell you what the songs are for this album. We've got Construct, New Life, Churches, Just Above the Clouds, Reset, Tides, The Real Me, Light Up the Dark, Dormant, The Last on Earth, The Trooper, which is the Iron Maiden classic. This is a fantastic version of an Iron Maiden classic. I'd love to know what I made and think of this, but I really like this. It's a brilliant, well-composed, structured song. We'd also have Dancing in the Dark, a bonus song, and also Numb, a bonus song. So there's three bonus tracks. So in total, there's 10 songs of their own, plus three bonus tracks. Dancing in the Dark is also a cover, which was originally done by Bruce Springsteen, and Numb is also done by Lincoln Park. So you've got three bonus tracks and 10 of the originals. Brilliant album indeed. Excellent produced, really arranged, really well arranged songs. And the chemistry and gel between Tom and Vikra has come really, really well strong. So the chemistry between Tom and Vikra is absolutely fantastic. These guys write some fantastic music together. I'm hoping to see the, them tour very, very soon. I'm pretty sure they will. But this new album is a great album. Like I said, it's a really good chill out album. Something to listen to, something different. So I'm going to tell you what my favourite songs on the album are. I really like the debut song, Construct. It kind of reminds me a little bit of something that Ray Alder would do on his previous solo albums without any instruments except for maybe keyboards. Ray would have been a fantastic singer for something like this, but Tom is a fantastic singer and he's done really well. He's certainly suited for the music, so Construct is a really cool opening song. I also like the song Churches. Basically, when I keep listening to this song, I can imagine Phil Collins singing it. Tom's got that vibe of uh, Phil Collins. It could be a really cool, mellow Genesis song, but the song Churches is a really strong, structured song. Beautiful harmonies by Tom, some fantastic composing by Vikram. Another great song from this album is called Just Above the Clouds. It's a really spacey out song, really mellow. It's the sort of thing you could just sit on the grass looking at the clouds and listen to this song. The song title says it all. Fantastic song. Really well put together, fantastic vocals and arrangements. So it's called Just Above the Clouds. The song The Real Me is a fantastic song. It's probably one of the best songs on the album. It does, like I say, have a vibe of probably Genesis. It's definitely if Phil Collins was singing this song, it would sound absolutely amazing. But Tom is an amazing singer. He's done really, really well. Now, one of my favourite songs is a song called The Real Me. This is a fantastically, beautifully composed song. Tom's done a fantastic job, and it's the sort of thing that I reckon Phil Collins could sing as well. But it's a brilliant song made for Tom and Vikram. Absolutely fantastic. It's a really mellow, chill-out song with a little bit of percussion and violins. Check it out, it's called The Real Me. Another really cool song that I like is called The Last on Earth. I'll say it's a very strong, structured album. 
very beautifully composed, some fantastic harmony vocals, great lyrics and music all around. All in all, I think this is a really good album and I suggest you should listen to it. It's something different from metal. And if you're open-minded, this is a fantastic album for you. It's by Silent Scars. The album's called Dortmund. I'm going to give this four out of five because I think it's a fantastic chill-out album. So Metal Edge, check it out. Let me know what you think with comments. Thanks for watching. Next album's coming soon. Take care.